Hello, my soccer universe. To a bit unexpected, no, not really unexpected. I knew that the draw will be happening, but it crept a little bit up on me, so I had to put a European background up there. It was not easy to put it in there. If you see Chelsea out there next to Bayern Munich, because they are just in there. Um, that's why also Real Madrid is here. This is for Europa League. Uh, everything else in Champions League. Everyone that qualified is already up there. And the other ones are kind of down there. I'm hiding Napoli, which is not so good. And I'm wearing Juventus because I couldn't find a space for Juventus anymore. And uh, so, yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, the Champions League draw has happened. We already know the Champions League will be now played out in Portugal, but the re there are four uh, return legs that are still happening. And as far as I understand, all of these are happening in the respective home stadiums as drawn. So uh, that's quite in, in, in interesting. Uh, here first, to, as, as a reminder, this is how the uh, round of 16 first legs ended. And most importantly, the last four, Napoli, Barcelona is a 1-1 draw. So that's wide open. Uh, Chelsea, Bayern, as I said, Chelsea bare, barely in there. 3-0 away win for Bayern. Real Madrid, Manchester City, 1-2. This is a big one. Um, more or less the reason why I put Real Madrid on the, on the side. They are outsiders, but I think they're not out of it. And then uh, Lyon beat Juve 1-0. So also a little bit of an uphill battle, but Juve will have the advantage of playing against the Lyon team that hasn't had any competitive games since the season there stops. So the return legs for those four games is Juve um, and Lyon as well as City and Real Madrid will be playing on the 7th at the same time. And then the other two, uh, Barcelona, uh, Napoli and Bayern Chelsea are um, on Saturday the 8th of August. So we know that. And then yesterday the draw happened and boy did it deliver. Uh, if you want to have great matchups already in the quarterfinal, I think this is what you will gonna get because it's so neatly separated the uh, teams that never have won and that have already qualified from the teams that are still uh, to, do, to, to, to be decided. So on the 12th of August, we will get Atalanta against PSG. And I think similar to Juve against Lyon, I'm not sure. I mean, if it was a regular... Um, League campaign, I would say PSG are huge favorites, despite Ata Atalanta being stingy. But with that break happening, and Atalanta really just finishing the season um, a week before that, I honestly think Atalanta has, has a huge shot there. Uh, PSG will not be uh, very fresh there. Leipzig against Atletico, um, almost similar. Leipzig has a much longer break than Atletico, although the Spanish league ends... Um, Next, uh, by, by, by the end of, end of next, next week, so a little bit of bigger layoff. Uh, but Leipzig is via Timo Werner, and I think Atletico have now shown that they can put something together. So I would favor Atletico there. And then the big ones. I mean, Barcelona, Na Napoli. For me at the moment, it's a coin, coin flip because I really think that Napoli has a chance of getting a result in Barcelona against most likely Bayern Munich. I don't think that Chelsea uh, will pull the upset. Uh, will be interesting to say the least i think that will be if it's barcelona bayern this is one of the huge matchups um, i would say bayern in any case uh fa favor if it is barcelona bayern or napoli bayern i think bayern will have the slight disadvantage of having only played the game against chelsea as a competitive game and then city real madrid against you Olymp olympic i mean whatever comes you would expect Juve to roll over olympic lyon uh at the moment but facing against City or Real Madrid, that sounds like a juicy, juicy, nice matchup. And to make it even better, the first two matchups make up one finalist. So um, in my personal dream world, uh, it would be Atalanta against Atletico Madrid. Uh, although Atalanta against Leipzig, uh, boy, this will be offensive. But I don't want to see Le 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 Leipzig even getting that far. And then, yeah, the others, I mean, there is a Bayern Munich against Manchester City, there is a Barcelona against Juventus in there. Um, that would be Messi versus Ronaldo. I mean, there is a whole lot of stuff in there and then the two will play out the final. I think it's an exciting draw, to say the least. Let me know, know your thoughts on the draw. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. 
Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos or playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day. Bye.